Hello, all my fellow Americans, and welcome back to another video where we will be predicting NXT TakeOver Battleground. And I have Drake and the Top G with me. Unfortunately, we don't have Donald or Joe here since Parrot AI took them off yesterday, but we brought someone else here to fill in the last spot. Introduce yourself. Thank you, Obama. As a wrestling fan myself, I am honored to be part of this predictions contest. Andrew, I'm coming for that title. Shit. Obama. How did you get Batman here and not just any Batman, uh, fucking Arkham Batman? Assume, well, welcome, Batman, but I have to tell you, you are not taking my predictions title. Also, why we got Kendrick's bitch here. Hey, Andrew, I stopped talking about that big meanie Kendrick. I'm just here to predict wrestling. Also, I'd like to thank the creator for bringing me back. Thank you. Hey, don't thank him, Drake. He probably wanted to bring Kendrick here instead of you. Just saying. Anyway, let's start the predictions. The first match of NXT TakeOver Battleground. It's a NXT Underground match. A match where you have to knock out your opponent or make them submit. My type of match, I have to say. The top G always knocked down his opponents. The first match is Shayna Baszler versus Lola Vice. Both women do have their MMA background. But Shayna has more experience in the MMA background than Lola. Lola may have a great ability to strike while Shayna can is a good technician, a submission specialist, so my pick will be Shayna Baszler. I have to disagree with you, Andrew. Lola Vice is a very underrated woman. Also, this fight reminds me of all my battles with Superman. The more weaker fighter will always have the advantage. You'd have to outsmart the stronger opponent in any way. I say Lola Vice knocks out Shayna. Lola Vice is my pick. Well, I have to say, I have to agree with Batman here. Lola could definitely knock out Shayna. She could definitely find a way to outsmart her. Lola Vice is my pick. Well, I think you cuties are wrong. Shayna Baszler will make Lola submit to the Kirifuda clutch. My pick is Shayna. Wow, it's 50-50 here. All right, let's go to our next match. It's for the NXT Tag Team Championships. It's the OC, the Good Brothers, Carl Anderson and Luke Gallows versus the team Nathan Fraser and Axiom. Honestly, Nathan and Axiom are losing this match. The Good Brothers are far more experienced than them. The Good Brothers are going to become new NXT Tag Team Champions. Well, Andrew, again, I have to disagree with you. You've seen Fraser and Axiom outsmart Baron Corbin and Braun Breaker. I have a feeling they can find a way to outsmart the Good Brothers as well. Nathan, Fraser, and Axiom retain here. Sorry, Bats. I think you're wrong here. The Good Brothers have been one of the best tag teams all over the world, in the US and Japan. I think the Good Brothers win the titles here. Um, I'm going to agree with Andrew and Obama. I really don't see Fraser and Axiom retaining here. The Good Brothers are my pick. All right, for our next match will be a triple threat for the NXT North American Championship. It will be Wesley versus Obafemi versus Joe Coffey. These three men will go all out to win the North American Championship. I believe Obafemi will retain here. He has been unstoppable ever since he won the North American Championship. Obafemi is my pick. Well, I think Wesley will win back the North American Championship. He got hurt and couldn't wrestle for almost a year. This is his redemption story. Winning back the North American Championship will put him back where he was before, at the top. Well, I think Joe Coffey is winning. Come on, guys. He has Gallus behind him. When Gallus interferes, that will give Joe Coffey the advantage to win the North American Championship. Joe Coffey is my pick. Well, I'm going to agree with Obama. Uh, Joe Coffey will win the North American Championship. I think this will start the Gallus era in NXT. All right, next match is ladder match for the NXT Women's North American Championship. It will Sol Ruka versus Lash Legend versus Fallon Henley versus Jada Parker versus Mitchin versus Kalani Jordan. These women are going to put their bodies on the line to climb up the ladder to become the inaugural women's North American champion. But I think since the OC are winning the tag titles, I think Michin will become the first ever NXT women's North American champion. Good take, Andrew, but I have to disagree. I think Sol Ruka will win the NXT Women's North American Championship. Sol Ruka has the athleticism, the agility, and most of all, the aura. I think Sol Ruka has what it takes to become a champion. Sol Ruka is my pick. Well, for me, it will be Lash Legend 
Lash has the heel work and the charisma. I think her winning that championship can evolve the meta for more. Well, you cuties are wrong. I think Jida Parker will win. Um, she has a, a large Gaiat, I mean, aura, and she's also very young. I wouldn't mind her winning at all. Jesus fucking Christ, Drake. You're even worse than Kareem Benzema. Maybe the creator should have gotten Kendrick here instead of you. All right, next match for the NXT Women's Championship. It is the TNA Knockouts Champion Jordan Grace versus Roxanne Perez. Honestly, Roxanne ain't no match for Jordan Grace, and I'm glad the WWE are partnering with TNA. Jordan Grace is my pick to win. Um, I agree, Jordan Grace is literally a real life Wonder Woman. She is a bodybuilder, and she can definitely destroy Roxanne Perez. I would love to see Jordan Grace lifting both the TNA Knockouts Championship and the NXT Women's Championship. Couldn't agree more. I think Roxanne Perez could put up a good fight, but she can't beat Jordan Grace. Jordan Grace will win the NXT Women's Championship. Um, you guys are completely sleeping on Roxanne Perez. Hey, you know what? I will bet $1 million that Roxanne Perez wins at Battleground. Um, I think Roxanne will have an ally by her side to defeat Jordan Grace. It's all about outsmarting her. God fucking damn it, Drake. I thought you got over your gambling addiction. I guess Kendrick was right. You are a gambling addict. Anyway, next match is the main event for the NXT Championship. It will be Trick Williams versus All Ego, Ethan Page. Ethan Page took out the metaphor and attacked Trick Williams two weeks ago. I think there will be a new era in NXT, and that will be the era of All Ego, Ethan Page. I completely agree, Obama. Ethan Page didn't do shit in AEW, but he's in WWE, and he will do numbers there. He will win the NXT Championship from Trick Williams. The era of all ego, Ethan Page will start at Battleground. And while you guys are wrong, Trick Williams will defeat all ego Ethan Page. Trick Williams might go to this fight blind since Ethan Page never wrestled in the WWE, but Trick Williams beat people like Carmelo Hayes and Ilya Dragunov. I don't think he's going to lose to Josh Alexander's bitch. Trick Williams is my pick. I agree. Batsy Poo, Trick Williams will defeat all ego, Ethan Page, to retain the NXT championship. It's all about whoop that trick, baby. Well, that is the predictions for NXT Battleground. Thank you, Batman, for showing up in this video. Leave a like and subscribe and comment down below on what you want to see next.